So how do you feel when somebody cheats? Um, sometimes when people cheat, sometimes um, people want to stop playing the game because they don't like how people are, are playing the game and they cheat because they just want to win. How do you feel when you think something's not fair? Kind of sad. Kind of sad? Um, like, uh, I don't care and like, uh, mad. And mad. Do you know what a do-over is? If um, you're like a superstar and like um, and um, you didn't like the video when they were taking it of you, you could redo it. Okay. Yeah, that's a good example. When you like made a mistake on your paper, you could like get another paper. Okay. Or you could erase another. Yeah. I think that's a good idea. So should people get do-overs uh, in school? Yeah. If they yeah, make no. a mistake on a test or a paper? Yeah. Okay, got another question for you guys. Do you guys know what a timeout is? Yeah. Yes. What, what's, a, what, what's a timeout? Yes, it's Emmanuel. To put you in the corner. To put you in the corner. Why? Why would you end up in the corner? Oh. Yeah. If you punch your little brother. Oh. Uh, yeah. <laughs> or my sister. When should somebody, when should somebody be put in timeout? If you, um, like, um... If you don't do what your parents say, or if you do the wrong thing all the time and, and you're being steal. bad, okay. again. So let me ask another question here. Is it important to finish something that you start? Like if you start a project, you start a paper? Yeah. Yeah. You sign up for something. Let's say you sign up for a team, I or you sign up for a class. I just signed up for karate, and I kept, karate. On, I kept on um, joking to my mom. I don't want to play karate anymore, but I joked, because, but... And it and it spent oh and it spent a lot of money. That's right. So if you sign up for something, you spend money. You should you should probably finish it, right? Yeah. So if you don't finish it, uh, why wouldn't you finish something? Uh, have to sign up for something and you um don't want to do it. You could just say I don't want to do this, mom or dad. Um, like you said, if you didn't want to do karate, you could do soccer. Mm -hmm. So you can switch hockey, and go different hockey. directions, hockey, right? Yeah. So I want to hear some advice. If you were going to talk to a college student, so a brand new student coming into college, what do you think the most important thing that they should know going into college? And we're going to ask everybody, so let's start over here. Manuel, what would be the most important thing that you want to tell a new college student? To read hard books. To read hard books, okay. Um, if he knew, like, time should track and all that math stuff. And, and, I, would, and I would ask him... If he could read a chapter book with like a thousand pages. Okay, so reading is really important, and I heard math in there too, right? To, to be able to do your math problems. Good. I would tell somebody if if they know how to do subtraction and stuff. I would ask the college student if they um study. If they study, is that important they for going to college? They study their yes. homework. Absolutely. If they uh, if they do their homework, because I know they have like a book full of homework. Okay. All right. There before. <laughs> and they needed to do a test. Okay. And you, yep. To be nice. To be nice to who? To like whoever your friends is. To the friends and to your, your teachers and, and teachers. other. Yes. Okay. Then. I got, I got to um stand up for yourself and also um be a hard worker. Great and advice. No cheating, and no cheating in um sports if they're playing sports. Okay. And show them the way in the school. Ah. What is what is the mascot of uh, the university? Owls. Owls, that's right. So, let's hear it. One more time. Hoot, hoot. Hoot, hoot, hoot. All right. Give me five. Woohoo. Good job, guys. Stretch. All right. We're done.